Hey YouTubers, good morning, this is Rob Muffet. Guys, today we're going to have some fun with something that was from back in 1970. Um, every morning I go to Survival Blog. I recommend everybody do the same. It's a great site. Most of the content is uh, written by the subscribers or the viewers. And uh, it's, you never know what you're going to find. Um, last month I was there and the editor said, uh, somebody should write a brief article or video on uh, how to use mechanically fired magic cubes for perimeter security. And uh, magic cubes are kind of cool. They're not electrical at all. They're uh, chemical and mechanical. And I thought it'd be fun. Just, there were millions of these made back in the 70s and the 80s. And still get them on Amazon and eBay. And uh, I went and bought one. The, the, what happens is there's a little wire trigger on a spring. And you slide it to the right and release it. And it uh, sets off a fulminate at the bottom as a, as a fuse. And then ignites shredded zirconium. <laughs> it, which, how cool is that? It makes a, a amazing bright flash. It's a one thirtieth of a second. So I got one, and uh, I thought, how could I make a trigger for it? And I got a little bamboo skewer and some uh, some sandpaper. And remember, the little trigger wire at the bottom, it's got to be moved and then released to hit the uh, bottom of the flash cube to set off the fulminate, which burns the zirconium. So it's mechanical, but you got to pull it back and release it on this little spring wire. So I thought what, what we could do is just open it up and jam something in there and, and have the trip wire pull it out uh, to release it like a cocked uh, gun. You just pull something and, and release. To, but you have to depress the, the, the wire as far as you can and then jam something in there. So we're going to do that, see what happens. Get some hot glue and, and glue your... Uh, flash cube to something and then I took the skewers little pieces of wire or, or, or wood and I sand them down and I use one of them to uh, slide in the slot and move the wire over and then I, I jammed the other one in there that way it would be over as far as it could go and then we're gonna pull it out real quick and see what happens boop it works <laughs> sometimes it didn't work every time but uh, now I took took it apart and you can see the get the guts inside the, it's really cool uh, 1970 technology there's little wires at the bottom hit this side at, at and the bottom has a fulminate I think it's either fulminated mercury or fulminated silver it doesn't say which one in all the literature I could find and then it the, it fires up the shredded zirconium <laughs> ah, that's so cool I can't get over that um, it's very simple design, wonderful design actually. No electrical parts at all. After I took the top off, I thought we'd see if we could do it again from, from the top. So I'm sliding the, the wire over as far as I can go, and now I'm putting another piece of wood in to jam it. And once that's done, you could tie a piece of string to it and, in, and have that hooked up to your trip wire. And when the trip wire was pulled, it should set off a flash. So this should work fine. It's really fun playing around with this. I don't get to do much. Everybody else is having fun blowing stuff up and shooting stuff. But um, where I live, you can't do that. So I could do this in the balcony and have some fun with it and show you guys. Let's see what happens. I don't know if I could have found a more inconvenient string. All righty. Let's see what happens. All right, works again. So guys, that's how you could set a trigger for your flash cube for a perimeter. Um, you just have to hook up a trip wire, and I showed you how it works. So you could you could use different methods now that you know how it works. If you want to know how to get them separated, uh, I got some hot glue on the sticks and actually got onto the, the, the top there or the bottom. And so when I pulled it, <laughs> it came apart. That wasn't planned. So if you wonder how to get them separate, that's how I did it. All right, guys. Hope you come back. I watch more. I put new stuff on every week. Thanks. Take care. See you out there.